Blockstream CEO Adam Back criticizes MicroStrategy short ETF as terrible product. Jimmy Aki last updated, April 8, 2024, 1624 EDT 2 minute read. On April 7, Blockstream CEO Adam Back criticized the newly launched Defiance 2x short MSDR ETF exchange traded fund. The ETF was created to short MicroStrategy, one of the most recognizable holders of Bitcoin. The Blockstream CEO shared his views on an X thread, calling the ETF a terrible product unlikely to yield the desired results. Blockstream CEO claims it's risky to short MSDR. He reasoned that even if investors considered MicroStrategy overvalued, the ETF would still face great risk due to auto rebalancing in a volatile market. Even if MSDR premium compressed but BTC price doubles, your talk short, he said. Price will overwhelm an AV correction, so you'll get wrecked anyway. And auto balancing volatile underlying assets erodes, capital to slippage and sideways chop fast. An MSDR is Bitcoin correlated and volatile. Per and second press release, the Defiance ETF proposed on March 7 was filed under the title Trust Roman II Financial Group. The ETF seeks to profit from potential declines in micro strategies MSDR stock price by taking a leveraged short position 200% against the company's shares. Backsided micro strategies. Massive Bitcoin holdings is a key reason why he sees the idea of a short ETF as a weak strategy. Micro strategy currently boasts a portfolio of over 210,000 BTC, worth around $15.2 billion, representing over 1% of the total Bitcoin supply that will ever exist. With MicroStrategy's valuation now heavily tied to its rising Bitcoin investments, Back believes the ETF's TWAX auto rebalancing mechanism to maintain a short exposure could prove disastrous. Michael Saylor defiant despite mounting criticism on MSDR ETF. Before Back's warnings, popular short seller Carisdale Capital announced last month that it would short MicroStrategy in long Bitcoin. The hedge fund stated that investors no longer needed MicroStrategy to access Bitcoin, and as such, they saw no reason to justify paying well over. Double for the same coin, especially with increasing access to Bitcoin through brokerages, exchanges, and ETFs. While MicroStrategy's CEO Michael Saylor continues to face criticism over his Bitcoin acquisition strategy, he reaffirmed that holding BTC is part of the company's long-term commitment. At a Bloomberg event earlier this year, Saylor articulated his bullish stance on Bitcoin, asserting its technical superiority over competitors, including those with higher market capitalization. Bitcoin is technically superior to those asset classes, he explained. And that being the case, there's just no reason to sell the winner to buy the losers. Follow us on Google News.